So, could the holodeck experience ever be a real one? A slightly ambiguous answer to this is both yes and no. To clarify the answer, you need to look at closely at what is needed to produce an interactive hologram. The computer programming power behind such a thing would have to be great, but not actually impossible. Current CGI can create highly detailed two-dimensional images once the parameters of any one figure have been worked out can appear to move in a perfectly normal and realistic way. Adding in a program where the figure can interact or respond to human input is perfectly possible. Combining these into a three-dimensional hologram would re require a massive amount of effort and computing power, but again, still within the limits of possibility. Current holograms are not actually detailed or realistic enough to fool the human eye and brain, but this is actually down to current limitations with the lasers, mirrors, fidelity and other technology, rather than an absolute issue with the systems themselves. So projecting the hologram isn't the issue. The main problem comes down to interaction with the hologram itself. If you do this at a distance, then it's perfectly possible However, as soon as you either make contact with the hologram or even pass in front of where it's being sourced from, the integrity of the hologram fails. Holograms themselves, no matter what other leaps in technology are made, are still just light. And as such, even if interaction was actually possible without the loss of integrity, we'd never actually be able to touch one. There'd be nothing there to actually touch, you just pass through. So, the full holodeck experience from, say, Star Trek or similar places will never actually be possible. But a holographic computer interface, like, say, in Red Dwarf, certainly possible in the near future. And further forward, it would actually be possible eventually to have a holographic receptionist or guide at a desk to welcome visitors or using a large data bank of pre-programmed responses to human interaction would certainly be possible. So there's a yes and no to the use of holograms in the future.